Well, it's been 24 hours since we saw this, that lightning show when wow. the storms moved through central Texas. And some people are still waking up this morning without power. We have been monitoring Austin Energy's restoration process for you overnight. And this was a screenshot from 1245 this morning of the uh, map of just how many people are without power, close to 900 at that point. And here's a look at the current outages. All right, closer to 300 people still without power. All the wind we had knocked down trees that then toppled down some Austin power poles. And that's why it has taken crews such a long time to fix. They say it's also a safety issue. My heart goes out to those people. There are going to be outages in any system. Our goal is to make sure that all the major lines, everything we can do quickly is quickly done. All the major lines that involve a lot of people are done and that we safely put crews in the field to investigate each difficulty to make sure that nobody's put in harm's way by getting electricity restored. The strong winds shook things up quite a bit and threw things around like this trampoline. It flew into this house in a Mainer neighborhood. You can check out the rest wow. of the uh, photos that we got from you on a gallery that we put up for you on KXAN.com.